Hey family, welcome, welcome back. My name is Lakeisha and I'm here on purpose for his glory and so are you. So I wanted to share a word that the Lord has been, that Holy Spirit has been um, impressing on me um, these last few days. So um, I pray that this word blesses you, that it encourages, that it comforts, and that it brings glory to our Heavenly Father. Okay, so... Even though we fall short of the glory of God each and every day, when we fall short of the glory of God, God uses our shortcomings. God uses um, those weak areas in our lives um, for his glory. Everything on the earth and in the earth was created for God's glory. And um, we all fall short of the glory of God. We all fall short of the glory of God. And God takes those fallings and um, use them as blessings. God's word says that everything that the enemy meant for our bad, he turns it around and works it out for our good. So when we fall short of the glory of God, when we um, when we're struggling with certain and certain areas in our lives, um, God knows our hearts and we should be counting our shortcomings as joy because when we fall short of the glory of God, God is using that for his glory. God will take um, our falls and turn it into a blessing. And First Thessalonians says, First Thessalonians 5 says, Rejoice always, pray constantly, give thanks in everything, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. So even when we fall short of the glory of God, we are to um, give thanks to God, um, glorify his name. You know why? Because that is being used for his glory. Everything that the enemy meant for our bad and working it out for our good. So I pray that this word blesses you. As always, I love you guys with the love of Christ. Until next time, you guys stay blessed and shalom.